In 2014, I decided five years I want to be fully self-sufficient, all manufacturing in-house, and that's what got us to where we're at today. I'm Charles Navarro. I'm the co-founder and president of Ellen Engineering. We started this business in 2002. It was a college project uh, that turned into uh, a business from a hobby. Our first product were billet air-cooled cylinders for Porsche engines and Volkswagen engines. And over the years, other product lines that customers have come to us and say, hey, can you make this? Or we have a need for that. And that's how we've grown. We started with a manual mill and we had a TL1 and a VF1. And more or less, we used that for prototyping. And at that point, we were still outsourcing. Through our experience, the Haas machines hold phenomenal tolerances. And a lot of the parts we manufacture we hold really tight tolerances that we're trying to hold a tolerance of two tenths on pretty much everything we're making. So this is a very common part for us. This is the uh, air-cooled cylinders that we make. They come in full bar, 12-foot billet that gets cut to, to length. The outside and inside bore is rough machined in the lathe and then it's fixtured into the mill into a uh, either a three jaw on this way depending on what operation we'll be doing and then we use a four inch slitting saw to come around and do the profile of our fins. We make spin-on filter adapters and this one in particular has an oil port on the side and it's meant to feed oil to one of our products that we make for the lay shaft bearing, that intermediate shaft fix that requires pressurized oil. So we make this filter adapter to get screwed into the engine, but with that extra access, everything can be done. So the part comes off and it's ready to go and we're not having to fixture and set up for another operation. With automation, in our last purchase, we added the Royal parts catching system and it was more or less a, a test to see if we could do lights out because up until that point, we never ran anything lights out. And we do quite a bit of drain plugs for uh, European applications. So that was our attempt to move some of our products to lights out to try to make up for lack of machine time. Making the decision to have our own machine shop versus outsourcing, one main reason was so we could have control of our product line and the manufacturing of that so we can make sure the parts are in spec, they're on time, and we're getting what we need and we know what's going out to the customer. And it's a testament that even the TL1, our first machine that we bought, it can hold a tenth, two tenths, and all the other machines that we have from Haas all hold those tolerances and we really never have any issues with the machines and that's why we keep buying them.